Nat 20. Welcome back to Nat 20, everyone. In our previous episode, uh, Zix Crater was crowned, well, not quite crowned, but he's been accepted as the King of Silsby. King Allen was exonerated, I think that's a correct word for it, from Silsby, where exiled would be a better word. Yeah. Uh, the crew got some potions and different things from Zix for helping them, and the crew are now able to do what they want. So who has the potions? Yeah, let's split yeah, those up. I want superior healing because I think I have the most health. I will take... You're also the one who can heal. Yeah. yeah. Oh, but I don't want to heal myself. So if if you go down, then no one else has a potion. Well, I mean, there's ten of them, yeah. so... I wouldn't mind I'll taking... I'll take two of the normal ones. I would like a superior one because, uh... Because you're greedy what's and selfish. Your, but what's your... <laughs> <laughs> no, it's fine. Alright, our class is 17. Is it again? I think a superior is 84 plus 8. I think so. Yeah, superior is a lot. Yeah, it's a lot. Yeah. What's your hit points? It's a lot of health. health. I have 33 hit points. How much do you have? 48. Oh, okay. I have 36. I'd be okay, right also, how do you have 33 hit points? By leveling up. I have 40, 10, you have 48. You have 2 less health than me, and you have no con. You could have I've, just rolled really well. Yeah. Even if you rolled really well, that's 32, <laughs> and you have no con bonus. You're... Oh, yeah, yeah. 40, 10, yeah. Oh, so am I supposed to be at 32? 32 would be the absolute max if you rolled a 8 oh. for all of your... When you leveled up. I don't understand, because I, I, I remember doing this right. Did you have a d10? It's a d8, isn't it? D8. Hmm. Yeah, so 32 would be the absolute max. I you remember gotten. doing it right, so... <laughs> oh, know. no, I got 32 HP now. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, well. so, uh, so what would everyone like to do? Would he humiliate me? <laughs> well, hold on. I wouldn't mind taking one of the... We, you said there was three regulars, right? Uh, there were six regular ones, two superior, two greater. I could. I wouldn't mind taking two regular ones. <laughs> There's greater and superior still. No yeah. one's taken a two of the greaters yeah. yet. I thought you said you took two of the I took three of the regulars. Oh yeah, because there's six regulars and there's two graders and two superiors. I have two graders. Yeah, so why don't you take the rest of the regulars and I'll take the two graders. That's what I'm doing. Okay. <laughs> so, so yeah. So, so I, I I took let's make a decision. <laughs> I thought you took a. You have the, one of the yeah, superiors. Yeah, I, I thought we. I thought I thought I wasn't allowed to take the superior because no. I'm the healer. Go for it. So that means there's one regular left because if you took two. Yeah, so there'd be one regular left for whoever wants that. Duncan. I'll take it. Uh, I didn't get a potion uh, yet. You got a superior one. Oh, you did give me one. Oh, yeah, sorry. I was, yeah. Never mind then, I won't take anything. Okay. I mean, sure, I'll take it. Nobody else wants it. Is there anywhere anyone would like to go in the city, or would you like to uh, head to the depths, or what you like to do? Let's no. go for it. Yeah, I'm ready to go. Okay, move on with this adventure. Normal healing is 2d4? Yeah. yeah. I think so, yeah. Okay, so, uh,. Beast Stack will lead the way and he'll. Or I think you guys also have your two horses and car- or and wagon from before too. Yeah. Oh yeah, Aaron and uh, I stole a wagon. And also the one that the K- that Cain Ulysses gave you t- at the very beginning. Mm-hmm. So now we got two of them, two of them bad boys. Gnarly. Let's just change out the horses. Uh, so you guys leave the castle and. Uh, head north, uh, northeast, and uh, you go on a somewhat tra- well-traveled path. Uh, you don't encounter you encounter a few people, but they're just random travelers. You assume you don't see any monsters or anything like that. Uh, and it is fi- It is very late at night now, and. Torian says, or shows that you guys are almost at the depths. Do we rest before we go there? Or uh, no, I think resting. I pull up everything. Yeah, but so. it's like, we're not going to travel all day and all night. Mm-hmm. Okay, that's fair. Yeah, sure, let's... let's are you going to like go to the entrance of the depths and rest there, or are you going to go just rest right here? I vote we go to the entrance and rest there. No sense wasting time. Um, yeah, that way when we're asleep, some can come out and kill all of us. Uh, Baron, roll a uh, insight check, please. Uh, 
That's nat six plus two. Um, so <laughs> eight. Uh, you're pretty sure you've been near here before. Mm-hmm. Some deja vu going on. Some deja vu. Like maybe not exactly deja where you are right now, but somewhat near here. All right, I'm gonna wake myself up a little more and be a little more alert. Okay. By a little, I mean much more alert. <laughs> I say let's go. Um, let's go near the entrance. One of us can just stay guard. I don't know if that's. I don't have. I don't know if that's a good idea. Oh, if you're volunteering. <laughs> if you're volunteering. You don't need sleep anyway. Yeah, I yeah. know, but so as you get closer and closer, uh, stuff begins to darken. Like the the trees themselves are kind of turning more black. Uh, the grass is all just black. There are some burn marks and stuff like that. And then you find a large tree that is. Like, wider than any tree you've seen before, and in it, there's a kind of passageway into the tree. Into the tree. And then, as you look in, it goes downwards. I want to sleep in the tree. Okay. <laughs> Everything about this feels wrong. That makes it right! Uh, and I'm going to go into the tree, too. <laughs> okay, uh, you're not going to rest before uh, going in here? No, like, I'm sleeping in the branches. And okay. I'm going to climb the tree and sleep up there. I'm okay. going to sit down right next to the hole in the tree and just sleep there. Okay. I'm going to go far away from the tree and make a fire and sleep by my fire. Like. Oh. Okay. I'll go with Farron and stay by the fire. Okay. I'll, I'll just lay up against the tree and, and rest and I'll yeah. keep watching stuff. Okay, so uh, it is weirdly silent here. Like, no noises of animals or other people or anything. You're way off the beaten path by now. And by now, after seeing this place, you recognize that you walked past here on your way from where you woke up at one point. You stay very close to my fire. Very, very close. Uh, is there anything anyone would like to do before you rest for the night? Are we out of earshot of the rest of the party with me and Perrin? Sure. Cool. Uh, so I'm just gonna sit right up close to you. <laughs> or not like, not like right next to you, but like across from you in the fire. And I'm gonna be like, so you're a human, aren't you? Behind that mask. Uh, you, uh, 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 no, I'm not You can human. drop what the we, shade. What made you think I, I'm I a can human? I forget, why do I know that? Uh, Zeke's called him out yeah, on Zix it. Zeke's called him out on it, mm-hmm. but he convinced everyone else that he wasn't oh, human. Okay. But you weren't quite convinced. See, I'm not quite convinced that you're not, actually. Fine. Uh, yes, alright, I'm a human. But you, you gotta not tell anybody. Well, I haven't told anybody yet, yes. so... Last I heard, they're not really fond, of, or they're not, they're not everywhere. Well, I, I... They're not the dominant race here, I just... Yeah, it's true that you re- 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 <laughs> rarely see humans in Taltania. Good thing dwarves are racist. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's just better for me to hide right now if people think I'm some other race that's more common. Well, I don't see the sense behind it, but you do you, man. It's your life, your decisions. You do you, boo. You do you, boo. (laughs) As long as we can trust you. Yeah, you can trust me for the time being. For the time being. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, What does that mean, exactly? You know, I'm not totally sure myself. Does that mean we're gonna get into the depths and uh, we'll come across some creepy crawlies and you're gonna decide that you're you know actually what? against us and kill all of us? And, <laughs> or, uh, or, st- and, or what? what? What's, uh, what? You know what, Ryan? I, I don't want to go to the depths because it's just spooky in general. Well, that's fair. I don't think any of us really want to go. I'm having we a have little a duty bit of... to the land. I really want to go. Blaze is a bit of an idiot, so he probably wants to go. <laughs> <laughs> I don't doubt that, yes. Um, but no, I, I have the sense that I've been here before. This is where I first came up when I just kind of woke up in the forest a uh, little ways. You've been to the depths before? I don't know if I've been to the depths before. I don't want to find out if I've been to the depths before. Wait, wait, so you just woke up? Yeah, I woke up in the forest a little farther in, and I, I, I 
come out of the forest to a road, and there was a, a gnome man on a cart, and uh, he, was he, a deep gnome. It was a deep gnome, yes. <laughs> they everywhere. It crazy. was the gnome that uh, you guys investigated a ship and found pictures of, oh. of, him, of him. Anyways, he gave me some helpful advice that, you know, humans aren't common here, and he gave me some gear to hide my appearance. Thus, I made my way to Silsby. But I'm not here. I don't. I don't want to cause wow. trouble. You know. I, I want to go back to my. I want to go back to my family. That's what I want to do. Where's your family? You don't know. I don't want to tell you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I can respect that. Look, you seem like a good guy, but I don't trust any of you fully yet. I don't, I don't know if I ever will. That's that's fair. I uh, can't fault you for that. But we've been together this long, so I figure you should at least deserve to know that. Well, I uh, I won't say anything. What about you? It seems you have a little thing about kids. It <laughs> seems just uh, want to protect them. Demonetize. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, of course. I hate to see a ch- child in pain. So, of course, I'd want to help. But why is that? It's only... A natural, decent thing, don't you think? Yeah, but you seem like it's a little more than a decent thing. Yeah, sure, people naturally want to protect children, but you seem like you want to do it a lot more. Like you would go that extra mile. Wow. Yes. You don't have to tell me anything, I was just curious. Well, you did. You told me some of your past, so I suppose I'll tell you some of mine. I, uh, I had a daughter. I don't anymore. Why are you laughing? <laughs> <laughs> that's uh, that's all I really say about it. That's all like, right. That's all that I about mean. sums it up anyway. I tell you a little something. You do you tell me a little something? Now we're here. All right. Well, um, I'm gonna stick close, very close to my father. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Yeah. I mean, Lazarus went to sleep. Blaze is somewhere by the tree. Aerendel just completely disappeared. Out of <laughs> <laughs> He's like He's walking down, down the road, like five miles out. Mall. <laughs> Mall. <laughs> I will. Walk. Yeah. Yeah. Right, so well, I don't. We don't hear any of this, right? No. Yeah. You're sure. Yeah. Okay. So we bonded a little bit. Interesting. But did you yeah. say it was like very unnaturally quiet there? Yeah, yeah. we're being real quiet. Yeah, okay, we're like, okay. Real no, quiet. I'm just, and there's a little sound from the fire right yeah. now. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I'm just asking as well. Um, well, you can stay by the fire. Make sure it doesn't go up, it's very important. Okay. I'll be right back. I'm gonna walk off to where I woke up. Okay, fuck. Uh, uh, yeah, after traveling for about five minutes, you find the area. I'm gonna follow him discreetly okay. because he just said, "You can trust me for now," and then he walks away. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna try and stealth after him a little bit. Man, I okay. went to bed uh, way too early. Roll a survival check. And Farron, are you trying to be sneaky about like where you're going? I mean, I'm trying to be quieter to not like okay. crack any wood beneath yeah. my feet or anything. But for the most part, I'm just trying to find the zone. Okay, I got a net one. Yeah, uh, you've actually lost where he is. <laughs> and you begin to feel lost yourself, but then oh. you're like, no, the, uh, I see the smoke and the fire, it's over there. And you're able to get back. <laughs> right. I think it would have been so much funnier if you just got lost and we had to find you. Oh my god, yeah. Uh, Farron, please roll a constitution saving throw. Alright, that's a nat 9. Plus <laughs> <laughs> I fucking hate that. Uh, that's G- yeah. Oh, saving throw? Alright, so uh, 11. It's like playing Monopoly of Tony. One, two, three. <laughs> yeah. One, two. It's easy to count out the die that way. Jeez. It's also easy to just uh, count The next thing you know, it's morning, and you wake up, and all around you, the woods are blackened. What? what? Excuse me? <laughs> and you don't remember anything from when you stepped into this area. Anything? Yeah. And roll an insight check, please. Um, down at the fire, that's an at 20. Ooh. You realize that this is four days after the devil gave, or the devilish person gave you the, like, four fingers up when you were in Siddlesby? This was four days after? Yeah. Ah. Uh, 
I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make my way back to the fire. Okay. <laughs> Real quick. <laughs> Um, uh, and you also feel a note in your pocket. It's morning now, though? Yeah. Oh. Alright, I'm gonna stop and pull out the note. It says, you will be of great assistance in the depths, and it's, it's signed with two devil horns. Huh. <laughs> it's like your signature, Tony. Like the little devil tail. Thankfully, your morning is enlightened. Uh, <laughs> as you approach the fire, you can smell the delicious taste of cooking bacon as I am <laughs> sizzling something in the fire. I'm gonna yeah, fold we the definitely note have out. a frying pan and some bacon. You don't and know what I have? Fire as fast as I can. <laughs> okay. Hey, where have you been? Morning jog. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do I make it to the fire? Yeah, you make it to the fire. Right. Uh, you look tired. Were you up late? <laughs> Sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. We're up late talking. Wait. Oh, what are you guys talking about? <laughs> it's still morning, boys. right? It's morning now. Boys. Yeah. We were talking about boys. <laughs> so for me, it was like flash, it was morning. Yeah. Uh, you just woke up on the ground surrounded by like burnt field and burnt trees and stuff like that. But you didn't, you didn't notice any sign of like smoke or anything. So I don't know anything. Fuck. I just yeah. woke up and. It's somewhat similar to when you woke up before. Can I notice he looks a little like uh, I'm completely just stopping. Yeah. Yeah. Do I notice? Uh, I'm wearing a mask. Rolling. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you probably wouldn't notice. Oh, okay. I mean, my body language is pretty. Yeah. I rolled. Shaking. Roll inside with disadvantage. Wouldn't we have noticed you've gone? Yeah. No, we were asleep, and it's the morning. Yeah, it's the morning now, so you guys are, would have been asleep. Well, I lost. Uh, it. I just, Ryan, I Ryan probably would have noticed. Would have noticed. Well, unless you went to bed like immediately after you came back. Not immediately. Yeah, that's but I mean, I knew he walked away. Yeah, you and just now didn't I'm there, and back. he just yeah. walked yeah. back. So I'm like, oh, he's going all night. <laughs> Yo, if I wasn't keep, if I, if I could just do roles that don't have disadvantage, I'd be doing really good lately. Instead, I got an at one. Nice, dude. Yeah, you at don't think anything's wrong with him. Man, this bacon smells delicious. <laughs> <laughs> not saying it. Uh, it said you will be of great assistance yeah. in the depths. And it's signed with devil horns. Uh, you can get it's metagaming allowed? No. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna eat my breakfast and, uh, wait for everyone else to get ready, cause I'm, I'm ready. I'm, I'm ready to just travel into the ground. I actually, I'll talk to Torian actually and ask him, uh, you know, when's the last time he was in the depths? Cause he seemed pretty apprehensive when we asked him to take us Yeah, through. he's, uh, he says it was... Ten years ago, and he didn't really go into the depths. He just found this place, and terrible noises coming from inside the tree. What noise? Uh, it was like the cries of the, of dying. Sounds good. Sounds like a pleasant place. I'm gonna screams. I'm gonna take my nose and throw it in the fire. Right. <laughs> <laughs> no, it brings. Uh, okay. Uh, but I ask, uh, you know, is he coming with us into the depths? He'll kind of sigh and reluctantly. He does not say yes. need to come with us. He's going to die. I just, I just <laughs> asked. He doesn't need to come. Hey, man, you don't need to come. Like you did the He's best. He's going to die. You already helped us He's get here. He's going to die. He'll He's going ask, to die. Would you like me to come? I always love having you around, man. But uh, <laughs> yeah, you don't need like to come you if you don't want to. So we'd rather you not die. <laughs> You don't need to come, but if you want to, your help would be greatly appreciated because we forgot to recruit people when we were in Stillman. <laughs> we don't need to. Uh, <laughs> one man army. He will come with you guys then. He will. Sick. Oh, hey, now that we finish our long rest, I'm yep. going to use my uh, Blessing of the Forge and give myself a bonus plus one AC on my suit of armor because that's something okay. I can do. You can't do that, like, infinitely, though. It lasts until my next level rest. Oh, oh, okay. I just gotta keep redoing it. I can also enchant weapons to give it plus one attack bonus and damage bonus. Nice. Anyway, so we're all gonna head down then. Yeah, let's go for it. I'm just gonna stay behind. <laughs> okay. Uh, wait, what? Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna say, <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> maybe it's best if one of us just stays by the entrance, you know, in case maybe it closes from some magical barrier or. Cool, or, you go first! Uh, <laughs> or, uh, you know, let some enemies come in from, from behind, right? We're going into the depths of hell, essentially, and you're worried about people coming in? Well, I don't want to get I'd trapped. I'd be more worried about what's in there. <laughs> I just want to make sure we don't get trapped in the depths of hell, you know? 
I think you're scared. No, I'm not. Much worse. I don't remember it. Uh, I think you're scared. Why are you scared? No, I'm not scared. I just uh, I think it's best. I just think you want to stay behind so you can trap us in. That's not <laughs> at all what I want to do. Can I inside check his intentions behind why he wants to stay behind? Sure. To see, you know, generally. Can he have disadvantage too? Why would I have disadvantage? If anything, I have advantage because we talked last night. I got a insight. Yeah. That's a 21. What he? What does he perceive through this? You're perceiving the fact that I... I don't, I'm terrified of going in there. I'm very worried, and I, I'm, I'm very unsure. Okay. okay. <laughs> and okay. probably more unsure than the night before. Yeah, a lot more unsure than the night before. Listen, <laughs> you're going with us. I you can't just cop out now, I man. I don't think I should. Why not? I just We could really use your magic. Ooh, my magic is just as effective out here as it would be in there. Well, it's the point is we need it to be effective in there. Uh, we have a four, rocky talkie, right? <laughs> right? Yeah, but Let's the one rocky talkie is with uh, King Yui. Time. The other one's with Zixi. Uh, I got one. And uh, uh, who do we give the other one to? Oh. Yeah, who has one? Lazarus. Didn't I? Have, I don't remember... I no, I had, I had it, and then I gave it to you when I couldn't decide what to say to Ulysses, and he was like, yeah. Well, he just wants to return his book. <laughs> 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 uh, so do you have it, or do I have it still in? Uh, I probably would have taken it back. Okay. You can have the other no, one. No, you're fine. No, you have the other one. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's just, you seem to really want one. <laughs> okay, but the point is, Theron, you can't just quit now. I'm not quitting, I'm just... You're quitting! I'm just taking a break. You're straight up quitting! You're coming in. I don't trust your devil work. <laughs> <laughs> but you are good in a fight. We'll need that. <laughs> Fine. 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 Cool. You go first. <laughs> no, no, no. All right. I'll go first. <laughs> oh, and does who here doesn't have dark vision? Just you? <laughs> I'm a dwarf, so I'm I got screwed. It. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm going to retcon and say that since Zix knew that the depths are dark, he would have given anyone who needed a reign of dark vision or a reign of dark vision. FBI night vision goggles. Ah, ah, the power Can of I dark get a ring of anyway? No. Sure. <laughs> cool. What? Cool. What do you need one? I like things. <laughs> you know, I, I can really think of greedy I dwarves. don't want to go in. I don't what? want to. Greedy dwarves. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> greedy. <laughs> hey, you, uh, Maul. <laughs> His name is Arendelle. Figure it out. No, 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 Arendelle died. Yeah, this this thing is different. <laughs> this thing. <laughs> yeah, you're really pissing me off today. <laughs> Just go down the fucking tree. We have stuff to do, and I'm gonna go down the tree. Okay. Uh, okay. I'll go up next to Farron and just quietly, I'll, like, cross him on the shoulder, and I'll be like, "You might be able to find some answers." <laughs> and then I'll walk into the tree too. I don't think I'm gonna find answers. <laughs> uh, and then I'm just gonna start going down. Okay. I'm gonna be at the very back. Uh, so you. This kind of slides down a far ways, like you slide for probably about a minute or two. You'd assume you're probably at least like 400 feet below ground at this point. And it ends in what you see is a pretty big cavern with large wide stack mites and stack tights reaching all the way from the floor to roof and roof to floor. Uh, and there are dead skeletons resting all around the cavern. You see two passageways branching off from this room. One to the west, one to the south. And roll a perception check, please, everyone. Why don't you just give me disadvantage? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> that's a nat 3 plus 2, so that's a 5. Dirty 20. Uh, dirty Nine. 20. Uh, so everyone except for Ailerindal and Farron, <laughs> you hear... Uh, the sound of a kid crying down the down, coming from the south. Yeah, no. I don't even say. You also, I vote west. You <laughs> also hear a lot of noise coming from the west, just like regular noise, like from the west side. Commotion, 
footsteps, stuff like that. Not coming your way, but just for the kids away. crying from the west. No, just from the south. From the south. Okay, it's I... just one kid crying in here. It's definitely a trap. Oh. But I gotta go. <laughs> no, but, but I'll grab him. I'll grab him by the shoulders. And be like, hey, listen, man. First rule of the depths is uh, that messes with your head. Don't uh, don't run in there. Uh, balls to the walls. All right. I'm not running in there, but I have to go check it out. It's probably not even a real kid. It's a trap. What is going we'll go on? We'll go in. <laughs> we'll take our time. We'll be careful. We'll check for traps, and we'll just check it out. Brian, what the hell are you talking about? There, don't you hear that kid crying? Do I? Now as you listen, you do hear crying. All right, well, you understand something, Ryan. We're in a very spooky place. I understand that it's, it's probably, probably a trap. It is a trap, all right? It's but an we got, I got to go check it out anyway. Lord. Look, talk to... He, did he, he didn't come with us, did he? He stuck? Yeah. Yeah, he came with the guest. Oh, hey, talk to him. <laughs> He'll probably tell you he's been here before. He can't talk. No, he hasn't. <laughs> He hasn't? No, he no. just went to the entrance. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm just gonna go. You guys... I'll throw my arms up in Ryan, despair, and I'll this. follow behind and be like, Alright, fine, but yeah. when we get attacked by a monster and you Thanks, pass man. out again, don't be mad at us. No, I'm gonna run and grab him and hold him back. I'm gonna try. Uh, I don't let him. I tried to break free. I'm trying to <laughs> I'll just do a strength check with you. Wow, we've been here two seconds. We're already yeah. fighting. 17. <laughs> That's a nat six plus uh, zero. Yeah, you're not able. You're not able to hold him back. Yeah, I'm else making a big mistake. Tunnel. You like from the south or from the west or both? From the south. From the south. Uh, all you hear is the crying and like the echo of that crying too. You see that the tunnel tunnel goes to a bend towards the left side. Uh, I uh, uh, I turn around, walking backwards now towards the sound of the cry. How about you let me go up ahead? I'm pretty quiet, I'm quick on my toes. I'll make sure there's if there is a real kid there, we'll all come together. But it's probably best if we just check it out first. How about that? I'll back you up. You know, every time I say I'm gonna do something, <laughs> someone joins. But all right, that's fine. Yeah. Okay, so we are you all of you going so. Or no. who isn't? Yeah. I'm not. You're not. You're not. You're just gonna no. stay here by yourself. This is a waste of my time. Just <laughs> waste my time. I'm stay here, here no for like okay. five Fair minutes. Enough. I'll check it out. Come back, and then if we really need to go, we'll rush in there. We'll save the little girl. I'll follow behind. Just out of distance. God damn it! <laughs> like, like a good distance, like with it, so I can still see him. But yeah, I'm gonna sneak yeah, in, feet. and I'm gonna try and feet. decipher what is happening. Okay. Uh, as you. Go through this passageway. You round the bend, and you see that it will. You assume that it will open up into a bigger cavern, and you start to hear that the crying is turned into maniacal laughing. The closer you get, I turn around. I'm like, "Told ya!" <laughs> <laughs> and I start walking away. It does sound like it's coming from a child, though. Listen, Ryan. When uh, sad sobbing turns into maniacal laughter, it's either a hag or it's either a witch, and I'm not down for Nothing either of those. Nothing good is that way. We should leave. We have to check it out. No, I just we have told it there for us to go check it out. We have to check it out. <laughs> hey, you don't need to do any of this. Whoa, how meta? Uh, no, seriously, we're leaving, man. I don't want to get attacked by some creepy. All right, monster. yeah, no, but like Ryan's gonna go check it out. And as, <laughs> as he continues I'm down this. <laughs> I'm also gonna aid him. As you continue down this passage, it seems to have an eerie coldness to it as well. It's getting worse and worse, <laughs> man. Please. Yeah, I'm hanging back with you, man. I don't want to go in here. So you're trying to hold him back? Yeah. Okay. Uh, roll strength, and both of you roll strength and take the higher number. There was a, another path, right? From, like, that, not the one that they yes. took? Yeah, I'm gonna go yeah. down that one. I rolled an 18. Fuck it, I'm gonna follow him. Because I rolled an 8. Oh, wait, oh. I got a 4. <laughs> uh, you are able to hold him back. Okay, listen, Ryan, it's so obviously a trap, like, even more obvious than when we first heard the cry. Whatever is down that tunnel is not a kid. <laughs> Every once in a while you do hear the cry, crying just beats out the maniacal laughter. There's something down there that needs our help. Dude! We gotta go check it out. No, we don't! He's bewitched. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'll give you a slap and I'm like, snap out of it! <laughs> yeah. That thing down there is not a kid. <laughs> That's not your son! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
I don't have a son. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> I got really into that. Uh, but no, seriously, we're not going. Uh, well, I mean, there's fucking nothing I can do because they're holding me back right now. Yeah. So, what, are you just going to drag me back to the main tunnel? Yeah. yeah. I'll try. <laughs> I'll try. <laughs> All right, I'm going to resist. Yeah, uh, just do, uh, again, strength against Ooh, the higher strength. This is interesting. I rolled a... I got 10. a natural fucking 20. 18. Well, it's <sighs> like you yeah, lost yeah, the grip. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're able to get past the Sweet. And then I just go. I just okay. dash and I run down the tunnel. <laughs> I dash and run <laughs> like what's your what's your walking speed? That's meta gaming. Because <laughs> <laughs> if you're dashing, it means you go fifty. And if I dash I go eighty. So <laughs> So what? I'm still I'm running gonna... down the tunnel. <laughs> How far is the tunnel? Oh. Uh, the tunnel is another about hundred feet. I just keep going. I just, I just I'm not going to stop. Right. Oh. Yeah, so eventually you round the corner and you see the passageway open up to a large room. Okay, and as soon as I see it open up, I like slow down okay. and I go off to the side and I try and stealth my way forward. Okay, so as you stealth and look in, you see it's a large room. There's a crack in the center of the room spanning from left to right. In the very center, it's a pretty big crack. Uh, you feel like it might go di- pretty deep. And then you notice in the very center of this room, there's a uh, small, dark green dragonborn child with glowing red eyes. And he is the one who is laughing and crying. I uh, I probably would have reached him by now, and I grab him like on his face. I'm like, oh, shut up! <laughs> Don't alert the dragon thing! <laughs> as soon as Ryan would have ran off, I'll yell down the tunnel towards Farron and Aaron and go, Ryan is out of control! <laughs> <laughs> Ryan is running! <laughs> I just think that kid, that, like, that, that video of that kid running around the pool with a knife, you know? Like, oh, what there? A knife! <laughs> no! <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna, like, I'm panicking a lot more than Ryan is, probably, so I'm, like, grabbing him like he's the one who's gonna make noise or something, and I'm like, come on, let's go! Okay. And the more you look, you see that there's a black glow surrounding him, with shadows and other shadowy creatures flying up from the crack. Up above, and they're flying all around him. Uh, uh, Let's not approach uh, the creepy demon dragon kid. (laughs) Anyone with glowing red eyes is not a friendly. I cast... Find traps. Since the presence of any trap within 120 feet, that's line of sight. Uh, in- includes anything that would inflict a sudden or unexpected effect that I would consider unharmful or harmful or undesirable, which was specifically intended as such by its creator. So it's not like an alarm spell or a glyph of warding or a mechanical pit trap, but not like a natural weakness in this war. Okay. Uh, you don't actually find any traps or anything. You just seem to feel some shit might be going down here. Well, I walk towards a child. Okay. So. I bash my head into the the, <laughs> the the wall. I'm like, God damn it! And I'll follow behind him. That is where we'll leave off. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what are the kid's gonna die. <laughs> what are we awing about? We're about to do another one anyway. Yeah. <laughs> uh, come back next time oh, to oh. see what happens next. Thanks for listening.